It's a moment ago. Billy Horschel two up for birdie playing Max Homa. Well, you saw it uh, halved in twos. Oh. Seen a lot of putts two made. seconds ago. Hmm. That's a nice looking shot. Catch the slope. Nope. A little too far for that. To go one up with one to play. And he saw the right to left. Right in the right edge. And Billy Horschel takes a one hole advantage to the last hole. 31 for these guys, probably their, you know, their gap wedge, 54 degrees, something like that. And will it spin? That's what I'm going to say when you go to that. It's okay. You can get yourself in more of a mess by going for this green and leaving yourself with a tough lie. Nice way to cozy it up. That'll do it. You know, one up win for Billy Horschel. Is this sort of meticulous pre putt routine, Nick? Yeah, it's all about getting comfortable, he says. Just keeps fiddling until he feels comfortable and then he's ready to go. Been working. All right, back over at 13 now. This is Billy Horschel in his match against Colin Morikawa, who's already eliminated the birdie to win the hole. So Horschel doing his part. He's now two up in the match. Seemingly in command of everything. Make this, he wins the match. Yeah. Hats off. Wow. So Mark Howell's week is over. Billy Horschel is a winner, three and two, two and one on the week. Right edge, looking for that left bounce. Fairway slopes right to left, so it should get some roll there. It's exactly what it does. Just a little left of it. Let's see if they get the number right. Will Let's that see. come back? Yeah, it's, it's coming. Let's see where it ends up. Boy, that's going to end up. That is a great shot for Billy Horsch. This pin is in a bowl. It's actually going to be pretty easy to get close to. Um, Streelman's hung up on the far left side of the bowl. And Billy's is looking pretty good. We saw Tommy Fleetwood stiff one just about 10 minutes ago and more of the same from Billy. He can play his way in, into Augusta for this this weekend, even if he doesn't win. So a little extra added pressure to the man that's now one down after one. Fleetwood is three up through seven on Dylan Fratelli. How about Billy Horschel? Beat Max Homa yesterday on the third playoff hole. Hit it close at one for birdie to go one up and here at number two against Kevin Streelman. And Billy Horschel is out quickly. He's three up through six. Pulled it a little bit. Come on, Wynn. Help me out. Thanks. Dustin Johnson, Kevin Na. Nah. Conversation. Let's go to 11. Horschel to go four up. This wow. is as well as I've seen Billy Horschel yeah. play in some time. Billy's got the head down blinkers on. And this was earlier Billy Horschel's second shot at 14. Down that left hand sand. That was very interesting looking into their eyes, wasn't it? Bubba had smiling eyes, I thought. Oh. oh, really good golf. That was a stunning shot out of the fairway bunker. Got a chance here now. This is a good long shot from 190 yards. Oh, oh man. What a shot. And that's what you want to do when you are one down. It was not an easy one. So electing to pitch it high, try to land it just short of the ridge that comes through the middle of the green, and then it releases downhill all the way to the back edge of the green. And just no way to stop it. 
Back up the hill, turning left, and whoa, look at Horschel walk it in. Oh, okay. <laughs> the Gators fired up, Gary. Yes, he is. Is Horschel just short of the green at the 12th as we set? With Fleetwood second in the water, Horschel looking to finally cut into this lead. Can't be much longer than the one Horschel gave. I think it's shorter, Zinger. Okay. Well, just remember that when the Ryder Cup rolls around, if you're there, Billy. Yeah, kind of a lazy nine iron there. He just kind of quit on it and kind of, I think he had too much club in his mind and he tried to take too much off it. Kind of left it out there to the right. Tommy Fleetwood's in here about 10, 12 feet. Oh, good looking putt for Horschel. That? Wow, that's fist pump worthy too. After that bogey at 13, man, nice bounce back for Horschel. This is good looking. It's a great shape cutting towards the center. And just gets through, but uh, well done. All right, mini version of the putt that we just saw from Fleetwood. It'll go hard right off that slope. Match this morning, round of 16. Horschel saying that uh, short putting his forte. And that's why he does so well in match play. Makes the ones he needs to. He did there. He's in execution mode. Let's see if he can execute a good one here. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that's a beauty. Oh, he needed Just that. what he needed, yeah. Make these to keep that other guy from celebrating at your expense. Oh, that's great stuff from Horschel. He and Fleetwood will head to the last tee. And skids, and if he just gets to the top of the hill, that is really good. Got it. Go. There it is. Nice. Wow, Fantastic. old shot. What a shot. Beautiful Fantastic. start for Billy Horschel. better than the one before well, the good old days of the world match play it was always every match was 36 holes so there will you had to be mentally strong because even you could be two down and you watch your opponent get a little sloppy and you put your foot down and over the next four or six holes and you could be two up this is heading right to the wind just turning it hard yeah, so difficult to judge. Now Billy Horschel, he's got the putter in hand. Well, good thinking. You've been using it so much all week. You know exactly how it's going to feel off that face. So how good was that? It's really, really well judged there by Billy. Here she comes, swooping over. Yeah, that's perfect. And it might get down to the red line. Excellent, excellent shot. It reached the, yeah, I'll give it to Billy. You can all have a go. I mean, that was a fantastic shot, 23 oh, no. feet. Oh, no. This fiddling is just so when he says, feels good, he goes, boom. There you go. A little bit of breathing room. Billy Horschel now, two up. Didn't love his drive. Well, luckily it was sand. He must have for a moment thought, looked at the water, but sand is fine. Could he played a gem yesterday from that bunker? So, uh... And Kutcher should be in control of that hole at 13. That's a nice lag okay. by Billy Horschel. His lagging has been extremely good today. TPC at Sawgrass. Could end things right here. This is going to be close. That's really well done. And there it is, Billy Horschel. Survive in advance. All the way to the final. The 32 seed is on to play either Matt Kuchar or Scotty Scheffler.
very win. aggressive play. Oh, cutting a little right of it now. Oh. Oh no. When will that stop? Oh no, that'll be dicey. Same thing here with Billy chipping right back into the wind. Should get this up and down. Or in. the fairway misses the green and this is a delicate shot into the wind did make it easier but not that easy billy made he made it look easy boy just perfect contact and you could read the label on the balls that came up didn't put all kinds of sauce on it just perfectly done so a dramatic birdie just a little left of it Oh, no! What are you oh, doing? Oh, my. Well, we did that twice. Decide, Paul, how much speed do I put into this? You don't want too much speed. You don't want to carry it too far. Nicely done. Wow. Okay. That will be a conceded five, and they will move to the 17th. Much speed into this one as he did back at 12. Just instinct and feel here, yep, right? Absolutely. Yeah. <laughs> he was actually trying to make it there, trying to get it to go a little left. Well, that's a good looking swing. Left left a bit. Left. Yeah, lovely nice. shot. Yeah, I just love this. Had to get left. And come back enough. So Scotty Sheffer will have a chance to uh, knock this in and extend the match. No! No! And Horschel is a world golf champion. PGA Tour victory number six. We know he won the FedEx Cup title back in 2014, and he has another big one to the resume. Billy Horschel indeed outlast them all, the last man standing. PGA Tour victory number six. We know he won the FedEx Cup title back in 2014, and he has another big one to the resume. Billy Horschel indeed outlast them all, the last man standing at Austin Country Club, <laughs> and the hat goes back. And it's a relief for Billy Horschel, who knows how hard it is to win out here.